Next, we're going to look at networking and sharing. We're going to go to our start menu and type in network and sharing. And you can see right here our network and sharing center. I'll open that up. I'm going to maximize it to fill the whole screen. There we go. Right up along top here, you can see a visual of our network. You see this is the computer we're on here. You see information about our public network, that it's a wireless connection. We have local and internet connection. You can see our signal strength is excellent. And down here we have our sharing and discovery. Network discovery is on, and if you want more information about any of these particular things, just click on the little drop-down menu next to it, and it tells you exactly what that item is. And then you can close it again. We have file sharing on. Now here our public folder sharing seems to be off, so we simply click on the drop-down menu, and again, we see our options, and we can even get a definition of what that is. So I'm going to turn the sharing on, click Apply, and there it is. Now I want to enable printer sharing as well, so if I click on my drop-down menu and turn it on and apply, now we'll be able to share printers that are on our network. Looking way over here to the left, you see a menu of options available. You can view the computers and devices, connect to a network, manage our wireless network, set up a connection or a network, manage our connections, and there's a handy diagnose and repair feature. Whereas if something goes wrong, Vista will help us figure out what that is. So our network and sharing center makes it easier for us to configure and work with our networks.